All right, the first step of making a background or a panorama shot in pixel art is to collect your reference pieces. I collected the following three. And what you're going to do now is, is you're going to very crudely cut them with the lasso tool and combine them into a, into a general picture that you actually want to draw. So in this case, I'll cut out the mountains here and add them to the background of the highway. And I'll take the trees out of the other picture here and I'll Photoshop that to the left of the highway. And like this, I'll kind of create already a really good, strong image that I can use as a reference to create this background in pixel art. After you've finished your crudely photoshopped montage of pictures for your reference image, I recommend adding some sort of layer with a certain color value and put it as a blending mode in color. That will unify the colors in general of this reference image and it's easier on the eyes. Next up, you create a layer in, that's completely covered in white color and you again lower the transparency but without a blending mode to around 20%. This is just another method so that you can now start sketching over it. Uh, now if you haven't seen my previous video, I highly recommend that you check out my pixel art basics tutorial because I will not be covering on how to set up the image or how to set up the right tools for the pixel art in much detail here. But the first step that I'd recommend is after that reference image that you created, you now downsize, arguably perhaps 20%, as long as your width and height is in the range of 200 to 500 pixels, so that the image is very small, allowing you to work in a pixel art mode. Once you've done that, make sure to change your brush to pencil and select a one pixel wide pencil brush. And then you just start sketching over your image. Make it as simple as possible because we won't be using the sketch even for line arts. Basically draw over the reference image that you photoshopped and add anything else that you want to add to your final panoramic picture. Once you're done sketching over your reference image, you can toss it out because all we need is that sketch. In the next episode, you'll see what we'll actually do with it by coloring over it with general color paint splotches.